It's Tuesday, March 2nd, 2010, and time for Live from the Future with Stuart Papp. Tonight's guests, Bryce Beckham and David Fickas with Jack Voorhees in for John Fulton and Jesse Schneiderman at the Message Center. And now, your host, Stuart Papp. Let me just say this, Ritalin does work. Thank you! Oh my God, my prescription just got refilled. It's live from the future. It is Tuesday, March 2nd, and boy, do we have a pants full of later hosen, full of fist, full of show tonight for your face hole. We have Bryce Beckham and David Fickus, everybody. Give them a big yeah. hand! The two greatest names on the show tonight. <laughs> Irony intended. Uh, Bryce and David here with the Iceman Chronicles. We have a, a trailer of it. They're going to come on and talk all about their gay Caribbean cruise. Ooh. Sorry, that may not actually be true. Can we get some real liner notes here? I didn't know. I'm sorry. That's next week, guess. And that's Brian Posehn and Don Olivieri. Uh, they will be here. Uh, Brian will be promoting his album, and Don will be promoting her hotness, which she has a lot of. Um, I don't do this show alone, although at times I wish I did. Lies! But lies all indeed. Yeah. I have the most beautiful co-host you could ever want. It's gonna be Jack. <laughs> I know it. Please say hello to Jesse Schneiderman, oh, everyone. Jesse. There she is. I, I served it right to you. I thought it was gonna be Jack for sure. Jesse, <laughs> you are wearing Smurf blue, and that is your oh, color. Can anyone, they can't see it. They can't. Yeah, I can't. No, see, they're... it looks like I'm naked from, from here. In uh, a way, that's not that. And then noticed. you can see it here. If you were naked, I feel like you would be a German news anchor. What do we have in the news? It's naked news. Naked news. news. Naked news with Jesse Schneiderman. With Jesse, that was sort of more <laughs> was Swedish, I felt, or Danish. I just wanted to make a comment about your initial Ritalin high. Mm. The fact that you use Ritalin yes. means that you're not really using it because no one uses Ritalin anymore. That was like in the 1990s. I don't use it anymore in the 1990s. <laughs> I have no longer, look, I don't have a drug of choice, but if I did have a drug of choice, it might be Percocet. And I'm just saying, if you have, like I had my molars removed when I was in, uh, when I was 18, and uh, it's the only thing, like you could wake up in the glove box of a Volkswagen, and you're like, this feels awesome. <laughs> like it's, I don't know, you could get. How did you get in there? I don't even know. I think my, <laughs> my dentist, this guy should be sued for malpractice. He, I think he wrote six on the prescription. Somehow it became 60, greatest two months of my life. Uh, thank you, senior year. Um, all right, we have uh, a special guest on music tonight. Uh, he is my favorite member of The Fresh. I'm talking mm -hmm. about the one and only Jack Voorhees. Woo! Jack Voorhees. Yes, Voorhees. yes, yes. Yes, Jack, yes thank you, Heidi. What? Uh, it's Stuart. I'm sorry, Brenda. Listen, it's important. I, I, Brenda's my sex I know. name. <laughs> sex name. I have not heard that officially. I just <laughs> a grapevine. But I, I know that uh, a lot of people people tune in and people like John Fulton, who's usually here. I'm sorry, and, he's uh, dead to us. I understand that you know right now. Right now, you're kind of like what? No, I no. So I did write a song about that, and I want to go ahead and play it for you right now. This is about you being on the show. This is about me being All on right. the show. All right, Jack Voorhees, everybody. Go. Well, you've tuned into the stream And you feel like you've been caught Cause it's the same show But I'm not John And it's like going to Ralph's When you wanted to go to Vaughn's Cause it's similar But I'm just not John So I don't know what to say I'm just doing the best I can And I'm sorry that I'm not A taller or handsomer man <laughs> So it's Tuesday night at 8 And your favorite show is on man. But tonight you're stuck with Jack Cause there's no John Cause he's in jail <laughs> True story Jack Morris, everybody! Oh, you sound delightful. 
Thank you. Um, you know what's good. funny about the, that whole uh, Ralphs and Vons and thing yep. is that there's you know that there's a place called John's. There it is. Which yes. is a ripoff of Vons. Yes, it's true. But I it's very didn't true. Believe it. John's. For those of you who don't know and are not in Los Angeles. Vons is like the ripoff Ralphs. Ralphs is like your generic Safeway, you know. Uh, Kroger is what they call And then and then you go to Vons and everything's like a little like, you know, like we don't have chiscuits here. We have awesome cracker cum. And you're like, oh, okay. <laughs> Are they next to the sleeping homeless guy in the houseware section? But then you go to Johns and oh. it's like a Ukrainian war zone that sells pickles. <laughs> and but those pickles are the best pickles you'll ever, ever have. That's one say. That's one side of it. But it is the most random meat section ever. You're like, <laughs> oh, I didn't know I could get horse steak here. Awesome. Horse steak. Okay, thanks, John. Oh, yeah. And there's mystery meat. I love meat. that you peruse the meat section. I do, because yeah. I, I go there to get... Um, Sounds like meat? love life. I go, I go there to get neck bones for my dog. Oh, that's disgusting. God. Oh, they love it. This all it's sounds delightful. like pickup lines to me. Like, In a way. For a neck wound? Would you, how would you can care to peruse my meat section? <laughs> Alright. Uh, we have uh, Bryce Beckham and David Fickus coming up very shortly, but... Uh, uh, we're we're going to do something that we haven't done in a long time. Now, um, I emailed everybody a couple hours ago, uh, a, a lot of our uh, faithful fans of Live from the Future, for a bit that we're going to do called You Supply the Setup. Now, Jack has a, a song for this, but I just want you guys to know, in, in full disclosure, we actually had a bunch of emails that LV, our producer, has seen. I haven't seen it. Jack hasn't seen it. And we're going to... I've seen it. You've seen oh, it. Oh, boy. Uh, I what? love when he cuts LV. So cute. Uh, we love our producer, LV. So she's seen these, gave them over to Jesse. But if some real great setups come in right now and uh, Jesse can work them in, great. So this is the bit called You Supply the Setup. Jack, give it to us. You, you, Woo! you supply the setup to these jokes. Oh, you, you supply the setup to these jokes. Oh, wow. Oh, you know, up. Jack has got a sexy vocal quality about him that I don't know if we've really seen from John before. I do, you know what? You know, we're not gonna, there's sex eyes. in the studio you know tonight. We're not going to compare. You're a beautiful girl, it's, Jesse. It's like comparing apples and assholes. Happen. You just don't do that. <laughs> I hope that I'm the apple. Oh. Okay. Oh, no, no, it's all right. It's okay. Right, here we go. No, fine. I just, that is all right, there. here we go. Here we go. All right, so Wait, you supply the setup. Now, by the way, just just for those, the hardcore fans, I need you guys to know that one night, Jack and I were at uh, in Santa Monica. There was a fresh show and a stand-up show, and he it was and I, Bonnie's Beanery. He he and I spent <laughs> no less than I would say four hours doing a gun show competition, <laughs> and it, it was so crazy that I actually. What, followed what's a gun me. show? Uh, well, you know the gun show. You know, you know okay, we're not going to do it now. But yeah. anyway, the point is... Brian knows. He wanted you to do one, Stu. Oh, you wanted the gun show. Well, Just we'll give, give me one. I'm give one. only focused on these setups. You know, you know, with the gun show. Ah, now we got to go there. Got okay. to me. <laughs> okay. All right. Here we go. All right. So, do you like seafood? Because these mussels are delicious. Yeah. <laughs> That's, That's exactly... Perfect That's explanation. That's, like, That's pretty much it. Okay. So, now what we're going to do... So, Jack and I have a history. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, it is. All right. We first, it. we got to have a three-minute time limit, LV, so that we don't go over it. For these five setups provided by you, uh, we don't know what these are. So, uh, let's have at it. You supply the setup. Oh, you, by the way, you, you, have, to, the you have to ring. You have to ring in. <gasps> okay, yeah, I've got, and I've, I've got, got some horrible now. whistle. Oh God, no! Wow, nope. And it's I've like, got a kazoo, which is <laughs> like an Alice in Wonderland rape whistle. I might as well just be like, "Hey, <laughs> this is the worst." <laughs> this, you, you have a kazoo <laughs> that doesn't work. Oh, you know what? I just, I just busted my kazoo. You know what I have? I feel, yeah. Is there an extra? Oh, kazoo? you've got. All right. Oh, that's set. fantastic. All right, here we go. Okay, you ready? Yeah, you gotta you gotta buzz in. I, well, I got no kazoo. Need I, I, need a, I need a. Oh, we need a new kazoo. I They're right my there. Kazoo, They're right next to you. Next to you. Yeah. Just make a vocal noise. Okay, here we go. Okay, this is from Senor Shudder. Okay. Uh, I can't believe I sat through all that ice dancing and not a single. Hand job. <laughs> okay. Oh. All right. I, look. All right, I got one. I got it. Okay. Do we do the setup again? I can't believe I sat through all that ice dancing and not a single Zamboner. <laughs> <laughs> He's good. Round. You guys also okay. might all know right. Jack Voorhees as Mean Peter. Yes. The uh, the IMer and chat room person who I often use his things because he's so 
clever. Wow, that was very well said. <laughs> I like said. You. I am a Speaking smart English. person. Okay, um, ready for the next one? Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. this is number two. Oh man, this is usually the guitar. I will, both I will serve you. Okay, here we go. Conan O'Brien is so mad at Jay Leno that. I was gonna say hand drop. Okay. Ah. Uh, this is from Gary Cannon. Conan O'Brien is so mad at Jay Leno that. This week he's gonna be the top. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's, right. that's not bad. Okay. Gay sex joke! What? I don't! Okay. Right, give, 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 give me one more time. One okay. Time. All right, go ahead. Conan O'Brien is so mad at Jay Leno that... He's going to... No, I got nothing. All right. I get round two. We're tied, I think. All right, here we go. Next one. Okay. This is from Chris Strait. <laughs> Seismologists say the Chilean earthquake actually changed the axis of the Earth, which... <laughs> si can you say that one again? Oh, you got, got, you got one? All right, I'll listen to it. Seismologists say the Chilean earthquake actually changed the axis of the Earth, which... Reminds me of Monique jogging. <laughs> All right, I got one, I got one, I got one. Set it up again. <laughs> that was good, Jack. All right. <laughs> Seismologists say the Chilean earthquake actually changed the axis of the Earth. Which is... Earth, which... Which is the first... Honest day's work South America's put in this year. Whoa! <laughs> huh? No, you mean Mexico! Oh, don't I? All right, come on. All right, here we right, go. Come Keep on. Going. Let's we got, go. We got two Let's more. Let's do it. We're doing you supply yeah. the setup. Okay. Tom Clark <laughs> Listen, I says. I can do this all night. Tom Sorry, Clark Bryce and David. Next week. Next week. Tom Clark says Now that the Olympics is over and Jay Leno is back in the Tonight Show, NBC can finally. Get laid. <laughs> Allow Jesse. me to kill myself. All right. Wait, set it up one more time. Now that the Olympics is over and Jay Leno is back in The Tonight Show, NBC can finally... Put back on the singing bee! <laughs> <laughs> is that on NBC? That's good. That's good. good. Telemundo says, I feel offended now. Now? You've waited this long to feel offended, Telemundo? Mwah, we love you. All right. Uh, well, we have one more? One more. All right, good. This is from Tom K. Video, Tom Kraft. Tom K., who does all the graphics. We the, love you, Tom K. The, eh, eh. the only differences between Jack Voorhees and Stuart Papp are five inches of height and... Oh. <laughs> and also the links of, our, of, our, of how tall we are. <laughs> <laughs> Zinger! That Thank was you. pretty good. All right, go ahead. One the more time. The only differences between Jack Voorhees and Stuart Papp are five inches of height and... Who has to wear the ski goggles for that scene? <laughs> what? <laughs> that scene? I had to Those something. goggles are right, getting right. dirty. Do we have any that came in live from the uh, chat rumors? Because I really, honestly... This is the most I think I'd had. like to do just a show where it's you and me. Which is in bunch lines. Do we have any that came in live, Jesse? Um, we have... Uh, Sergeant Silent wants to know if you're wearing a bra. Wait, which one of us? That would Stewart. be me. I am, I am, I am lactating, but not wearing a bra. Fair enough. Okay, <laughs> not really a setup. All right, we, that's how we do. You this supply the setup. Word. I'm gonna give you a setup. Okay. 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 <laughs> Usually you do that. Take your time. Take your time. Okay. okay. Oh, I gotta think of it. Okay. The 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 main reason. Why Jesse's so cool is because. Uh, you want to take this one, Jack? <laughs> uh, yeah. Um, cause she don't. I'll set it up again for you guys. Again. Yeah. Oh yeah. The main reason why Jesse's so cool is that. She totally doesn't tell on me when I masturbate in her car near a playground. Ooh, oh, touche. I, I was gonna said. say because she reads my manual. Your That's manual. how you, you supply the setup, yeah. Jack. Take it away. You, Woo. you, you just applied the sets up to those jokes. Oh, you, you supplied yeah. the setup to those jokes.
Uh, all right, Jack Voorhees doing a great job. Jesse Schneiderman here. We have David Fickes and Bryce Beckham coming up shortly. We're going to do 30 seconds of I Am Names so you can find out who else is in the chat room. We have a bit of a lag going on tonight, so uh, we may not see your questions, comments right away. Uh, but stick with us, and we'll get to, to them as quickly as we can. Uh, it's live Tuesday, March 2nd, 2010, and uh, we're live at 824. So if you have a lot to contribute, find us at the stream.tv. Quick little thank you before I throw it to 30 seconds of I Am Names. We had a couple people donate last week, and I just want to say a big oh. thank you uh, to Morib Lehrer. We had uh, Senor Shutter and Lyle Thompson. Oh. Thank you. If you want to donate, you I can, can go finally to get my medicine. the stream.tv live for the future, and uh, you'll see a donate button. Five bucks gets you stickers. Ten bucks, you get a signed headshot of all me, John, and Jesse. We'll even th throw Jack in there. So that's oh. how you do that. Now, 30 seconds of I Am Names, Jack and Yesy. Oh, 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 okay. Start! Well, no, we're not ready. Let's go. And now, Aliens, A. Carol, Andrew, Assassin, Basketball, Big Webby, Blender, Blue Wings, Brady, Brash TV, Broken Sausage, Cherry Pie, Chloe Fierce, Church, Craig Hayes, Cream Puff Lover, Cynical Optimist, D. Batten, Degenerate, Devante, Dick Nam, Drink Moxie, Elohim, Fat Lee, Dama, Fatty Bum Batty, Film Fan Fresh, Gotcha Mac, Ground Pounder, Happy Hour, HD Rebel, Hurts Donut, Joe's Slef, Justin, Killer Nail Bunny, Night Art, Loyal Casanova, Man, Coles, Matt Man, Monk, Movie Matt, O Dog, Piston Hammer, Sean, Senior Shutter, Sergeant Silent, Sociology Geek, South, Time. South the Mother, Fla yeah. the Mother. Well done. All right. A little check. -in. That 30 seconds of irons was brought to you by cocaine. Yes, it was. <laughs> that was that. All right. Uh, I have a little trailer of our next guest project, uh, one of their many projects, but this is a, a trailer that's on my damn channel. Bryce Beckham and David Fick has put together the Ice Man. Why does Do you know, there hasn't been a murder recorded here since 1967. Well, Blythe is a quiet town. <laughs> Chief! Chief, what happened to Saul Miller? Wait! It looks like murder. Murder? What do you mean? Like someone murdered him. Sweet geeky prom date of the Lord is back! <laughs> Did you just eat a taco? You ever seen that before? I get most of my work as a veterinarian. <laughs> Pick me up a double bacon cheeseburger cooked to the perfection of my dreams. Why are you dressed like that? What exactly did Saul say to you? Find the book I used to read to JD when she was little. Oh, we're made. Go, 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 go. My influence in this town runs deeper than you could possibly fathom! There's a dangerous killer on the loose. Mm. Grab your kids, head for the hills. Forget the elderly, it's too late for them. Beware! If there's any terror left in your heart, I get so giggly! Use it! Use it now! Fair child out. My guest, Bryce Beckham Ooh. and David Beckett, everybody. Yeah. 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 Welcome, 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 welcome. Thank you. Welcome. Thank you. Thank Thank you. Thanks very much, too. Um, first of all, uh, Iceman Chronicles, Chronicles. is yes. a, yes. uh, I watched a bunch of episodes online. Uh, for those who don't know, tell them what it's all about. Well, it is not the Eugene O'Neill play, which we also did some writing on as well. Yes, but, we, but we, we were ghosts on that. Yes. We Classic ghost in. writing. Yes, mm -hmm. yes, uh, we were very young. Uh, the Iceman Chronicles is kind of a, uh, uh, it's a comedy we've wanted to do for a long time. Uh, um, I was a huge Twin Peaks fan growing up and I always thought, no, let's let's do a something there, weird. There could be something. Well, something there was weird, Twin Peaks was very funny. Murdery mystery. And uh, murdery. and we we always murdery. wanted to do something that was a similar small town, but also you know have a comedy in there and kind of cross the genres between between something that would have like hooks like Lost and Twin Peaks and stuff like that at the same time. Comedy. Right. And having these characters be a little you know a little bigger a little uh, and and then you can kill them. Right. And, and also like when SNL has a character that's annoying, you know, I always think. Maybe it's time to kill them. <laughs> yeah. And uh, in this show, we can do that. We can, we you know, we can like murder people, that. and then we can we'll, flash we'll back. Kill as many characters as we can. Yeah. Uh, so, how many episodes have you guys filmed of the Iceman Chronicles? There were right? six. Six. Uh, yeah. Someone noticed Michael Cornacia in there, and yep. that was that was before he lost all his weight. So if yeah. we get, if we yeah. get picked up, we gotta. Yeah, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to write that, that in because he lost seventy five pounds. But Ooh. yeah, very wow, very that's good. That's like yeah. losing Webster. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He actually, actually did lose Webster. Yeah, yeah. That's that's how he did it. Which is weird. That's actually the name of my first porno, losing oh. Webster. Losing wow. Him. You don't want to know how you lose him. It's, I don't. It's like losing, losing Isaiah only. Super oh, awkward. Yeah. Anyway, awkward. um. So, uh, like the, by the way, uh, I have to always say this, but um, 
the episodes look really great. You have a, clearly a talented production department. <laughs> thank, um, thank you. Thank you. But here's You're looking the, at it. it yes. Well, oh, all right, fair enough. <laughs> no, that's not true. Um, we work with many no, we do. We fine, work with wonderful many, people. Many people. But uh, I, I kind of want to understand the production schedule that you guys do for the show because um, you know, you can get so much done with very little, but the one thing that nobody talks about is how much effort that goes into it. So take us through a typical episode. How many shooting days? Uh, wow. How many locations? I mean, I know it's hard to say per, but on average, what would you say? And then a cutting time, you know, to put it together. What are you looking at? Yeah, well, this this particular project, we, we, we were shooting this and another project right. at the same time. Simultaneously. So, so, so we were basically group and, shooting. Yeah, except we, and we were actually kind of switching back and forth depending on locations and stuff. Group so. shooting? Are yeah, you laughing more back and forth? Group and shooting. We, we uh, had someone group shoot all over yeah. my face. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, when, when after group the group shooting, shooting, we towelled off and we... Nice. Um, yeah, got um, back to work. That's just going with the pace yes. carve. How are you guys? Uh, that's all right. That's all right. <laughs> um, I'm emotionally uh, five. <laughs> We uh, so so we were kind of bouncing back and forth uh, uh, between two shows. Is that is that dirty too? Bouncing back and forth? No, I, we're hey, it's all gonna be okay. it's all gonna be dirty. It's we a, might as well uh, just go with it. We'll work it in. And uh, I think what? How many days did we shoot that? Because uh, we were kind of it was a we were kind of pressed for time. It was a, it was maybe five or six yeah. total. Yeah. So it was about uh, three days episodes, per shoot, and it was about I don't know fifty minutes of content altogether. Yep. So and then we cut, you yeah, know, yeah, for, uh, for for the oh, two. So you're, for the sorry, two shows. so you're saying for both projects? Yeah. Are you guys arguing about it right here? No, it yeah. was five well, days, I mean, Bryce. It was five. You want to fight about it? Yes, no. I do. Can't do it. I, mm. um, so uh, and this is on my damn channel. Yes. Uh, yes. And I checked out. They have a whole bunch of shows. How does my damn channel work? Is it also on television? Just on the web? Does anyone care anymore? I, I don't <laughs> think no, it really. matters. Like, I don't think it matters to anyone. Right. But uh, but no, that is just on the web. Um, okay. I, I would, we would love it if uh, Iceman could, could go to television. That would television. be fantastic. Right. We see it as a much bigger world that we. Any, any love network to. execs out there? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Bring it. Bring it. We want to do sixty-five episodes. Okay. Um, well, in my damn channel is uh, they've been great. By the way, I just yeah. want to say thank you. They, yes, they did a deal with the channel. fifteen yeah, gigs thing. Under the bus. Oh, but we love you guys. Yeah, no, 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 no. I, they're fantastic. Nothing. They've been great. I, they have some great stuff on there. They have the David Wayne show that's really funny. Wayne days yeah. and uh, so. yeah, and pilot season with. Uh, I guess everybody sees their you know project is like well we want it to go you know who wouldn't want it yeah like, 100 right. episodes yeah. or whatever you know sure well, and we wrote it to to also you know the six episodes if you if you put them together and rearrange them a little bit they they kind of come out to like a half hour pilot yes. so there you go we yes. would love for that to be able to go there but so uh, i'm hanging out with Bryce and David they are from the Ice Band Chronicles but many other projects as well um, you guys, uh, obviously, you've been working in Hollywood for a long time. Uh, you went to SC and you did the film school. I thing. did the film and theater. So, so was, how did was, you? That's I was actually bilingual. Where, yeah, we met in theater. Film and theater. Yes, mm. yes. It I was, had some tap in there, and you've got the. I, I'm a, yeah, I'm I a quadruple threat. Yeah, nice. I did. That, I, I actually did wear my tap shoes when I graduated college, and I, uh, I, I missed the days excited. when actually like your like proclivity to be able to tap dance and sing was actually a threat to other people. Yeah. At this <laughs> right. point, like, yeah, it's now you're like a guy's gonna. Steal your wallet. I know some soft shoe yeah. that'll serve your ass. Like. Yeah, lay, not, no, don't mess with him. He can dance yeah, too. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. This is back in the. Yeah. Now, if you know Taekwondo, you're like a septuple yeah. threat. Yeah. Exactly. Uh, I mean, you if know. you honestly like triple threat in reality show terms, like she's got herpes, she's done nude <laughs> photos, and she's got a sex tape. Like that's yeah. the triple yeah. threat now. More yeah. dangerous or, than or the quadruple speak threat. And move We're working on it. We, uh, we we did the sex tape. We just haven't put it out yet. Yeah. So, um, now, uh, uh, something, uh, you know, you got your start uh, in theater, but you also, people know you from Mr. Belvedere. Yeah, Would you or, like or, or they don't know Belvedere, me from Mr. Belvedere. Right. Or, or, yeah. Well, but here's the thing. You don't really get but, spotted but so much. He, Yeah, I don't, I yeah. don't. But it doesn't even matter because you were doing sitcoms in the golden age of the sitcom. Yeah. I mean, there is no more fertile, more popular time in American culture. It's true. Sitcoms, I mean, that was my babysitter. Like, mm -hmm. it, was, it was a huge part of our life at the time. It's no longer... Uh, they're still around. People are still, you know, making them. But you know, there's golden ages, and mm -hmm. that was the golden age of the sitcom, at least in my opinion. Yeah. I mean, you know, if it wasn't for that pesky, sexy robot Vicky, <laughs> who was my temptress, <laughs> I would have loved you guys. Um, no, but uh, Mr. Belvedere and all the uh, the other shows. But um, I'm very curious how you got into that. You know, coming from because my parents just basically locked me in a room with like a thesaurus, and we're like, <laughs> see you in high school. You know, yeah. whatever. How did you get to be on that? Show? Show. How did that come about? Uh, I started acting as a kid because I was I was really into art, 
Okay. Uh, I was gonna be oh, I was gonna be paint, an artist. Right? Uh, I do I do some graphic design mostly cool. on it's all, it's all computers now. I, yeah. I barely I rarely pick up a pencil anymore. But uh, uh, I was gonna go to art school was my was my big dream then and uh, so uh, my aunt th who went to USC School of Theater thought right. I had a, a, a talent for acting and. Uh, convinced, but based on what, yeah. like charades? And I like, just just kind of playing games, just facial lying. expressions. He's very good at right. lying. Yeah, I was. I'm, I'm a terrible liar. Yeah. By <laughs> the way, um, so you know, ask me anything, uh, and I will not be able to lie about it. Uh, Is Bob Euchre hung like a horse. Come uh, on. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh God, yes. That's the truth. That is but, the truth. I, um, but so, how did so, Ant support yeah, you? So well, I, you did an episode of Alice, didn't you? I did an episode. An episode of, that was Alice? my first job. Yeah, but uh, that was awesome. But yeah, they, we were. We basically the idea was to see if I could make a little money to pay for my future. Right. So so yeah, I started so, auditioning. And I that was an gone up and, his nose at age eleven. Right. Yeah, it was really gone. sad. A lot of lot mm -hmm. of blood. Mm -hmm. So how do you guys hook up? Uh, where did you meet? How did you form? We, we were in USC. theater school. We were in theater school at USC. Yeah. Theater school. We were in the theater school at the University of Southern California. So Richard Attenborough and I were. And we studied very, very hard. See how long you can do that noise. Because men. Bend, bend, bend. Hot theater school sounds amazing. Is it awkward this I is awkward. Because it was so awkward when he played it. Awkward, yeah. awkward. It was strange uh, turning point <laughs> in the show. Uh, I won two, by the way. Everyone remember okay. Bryce's The show two. has become a subtone. I'm not even like <laughs> yeah. a. I want to thank you, by the way, for, for rolling out Jack for our for our show. Because uh, boo, yeah. boo John, right? What? Boo to John. Yeah, who's that guy? Boo. No. Jack is here. And Jack yeah. is here. Yeah. Don't you he is dare out. He's out. Jack. He's no, no, look at John don't behind Jack. Jack. He's looking at. No, this is great. The best thing is that. Brian, cut to the. I got to play with the full tone. He's going into your head. He's like, I'm going into your head. The whole thing about this band is all they do is move very slowly and smoke cigarettes. Watch. Mm. Oh, there you yeah. go. Moving slowly. You're right. Somebody's got to smoke. I know it. Oh. I know there's a smoke. Oh. Oh. She looks like the. They Muppet never actually right start playing. Like the Muppet so. right there. The what's the, the, the Janice? Exact? Janice the Muppet. All right. Yeah. Okay. Yes, <laughs> guys, come on. Oh my gosh, man. man. Let's all go in the jacuzzi. <laughs> hey, that was good. Thanks. That's um, great. <laughs> I do some things like Where'd that. Where would we leave off? Where were you guys? Where we met? Uh, yeah. Yeah. The no, we were, in, we were in college. And, in the uh, theater school. And uh, we and started was... doing, actually, we, I, we had done, the first show, the first play I did, uh, I, I started doing these independent student productions, and one of them was the Iceman Chronicles. Right. And it was a, it was a play uh, back then, and I had done one in high school, and I... I uh, Where'd you grow up? I grew up in Arcadia, California, okay. home of Sea Biscuit. Ah. Uh, mm -hmm. So not far. We're, uh, there's a third partner in Drama 3-4, which is our company. Yep. Um, and uh, all three of us are California natives. Yeah, so we're all kind of local. Very, we're very cool. proud of our California heritage. Um, it's rare in this business. No, yeah, it is yeah. indeed. We didn't transplant here at Where all. Where are you we from? Pride? Oh, it is rare in this business. Yes, Pride. Yeah. <laughs> um, I, uh, He's Chicago from and then Canada and then Boston. Right. See? Yeah. Right. So, so uh, there you go. Nice. No. Proof That's of everything little, we said. Is, is. Uh, so, so I, we were doing the Iceman Chronicles. I did another show, uh, and then Bryce, I cast Bryce in a show, and, mm -hmm. and uh, he just kind of he, he gave it gave it his all. It was a big. He gave musical. 100. percent He did. He was I paying did, sets till Thanks. six in the morning, I and, knew and uh, I knew you had it in you. And uh, I'm, we I'm started, very diligent. Yeah, we just started. Uh, we started writing together and uh, shooting movies together and all that kind of stuff. So, so. And, and Iceman Chronicles. That's one of the productions. Uh, drama 34com That's yes. the website. Yes. yes. All yes. right. Um, we're gonna get some questions for these guys lined up. So if you have questions, Jesse Schneiderman is your portal. I, I have um, a question. But while Ooh. oh, you have a question. Oh. Yeah, Jack Voorhees. Jack, um, Jack Von Voorhees. Did did you guys and the uh, the kids from Charles in Charge ever like fight? No, okay, that was I was actually good friends good with friends, the kids from yeah. Charles in Charge. You guys well, all which ones? Along. Like Nicole Ager, the second wave or the first wave? Uh, I don't even know what you guys are talking wave? about. Charles in Charge is a television don't act show. Like you didn't come on, say Scott Bayo. Is she fourteen? Yes, what? What? I'm fourteen. She came I'm the not, wave uh, after. Right. I mean, uh, she, right. she was more. So of you were step the, by wait, step. Were you there you was a step by step. There's like a nine. Wow. That was in Iceman. Was the girl from Step by Step? Did they do like Charles in Charge the new class? I thought she looked familiar. I know what has happened. Into this interview, we went from <laughs> we all just started we went talking. from started passive aggressive, me. kind of douchey question, Jack Van Voorhees. I'm just yeah, saying, to step by step, big shoes to fill. All right, um, let's do a little game here while we're waiting for questions from. We've the, got oh, questions. Game. What is questions. happening? Can't I run this damn show the way I want? 
Go ahead with the questions. Okay, <laughs> this is one question uh, from Sergeant Silent. Between the two, who has more talent? Also, does the less talented one get paid less? Hmm. Mm -hmm. Again, very poignant, mm -hmm. Sergeant. Mm -hmm. We are both so talented in different ways. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, but yeah. I Bryce am more is, so. Bryce is smarter than I am. Right. But I'm stupider, which sometimes makes me more talented. For instance, <laughs> he used the word stupider, yes. which isn't really a word. See? Ah, uh, touche! Bryce touché. Beckham again. By the way, that's, that's a new sitcom I'm writing. Bryce Beckham again. Right. Mm -hmm. And every time, what's going to happen? Calamities. Okay. And then, at the very end, you'll come in very cavalierly and save everyone. Go, this is Bryce Beckham again. Yes. <laughs> but you're gonna have to deliver right to the camera. I'm, I'm fine with that. So like a burning building will be falling onto an orphanage, and you'll just put up one finger, Bryce Beckham, again. again. That was me. Coming this fall to NBC. <laughs> oh no, we, do we have a soundtrack? That's a, My yeah. bad. That's all <laughs> I got. Bryce all right, do we have yeah. another real question? Because Sergeant Silent. Oh. I don't want any more from Sergeant. She's I'm dinging. The okay, bell. Go ahead. She's dinging. We have a game. But this is a really good one. But we have a game. This is from Telemundo. All right, Telemundo. Telemundo, who Telemundo. you offended? I... How was it to work in one episode of The Wonder Years? And is Winnie Cooper was hot back then as she is now? Someone IMDb'd me. Yes, they did. <laughs> um, All night long. Yeah. Uh, All night long. That was fun night. to do, The Wonder Years. Was that the question? Yes. No. Was Winnie Cooper hot still? Well, right. No, that, no. I, I got and the second is, part. Is Winnie Cooper was hot back then? Is Winnie as Cooper is was she, hot? Is she was hot? Back then as she is now? As that, is that's right. she yeah. is now. She does all the math um, stuff Yeah, now. she's all she's mathy. Really, Actually, she's hot. supposed to be on this show. Oh, great. I'm not even kidding. What, tonight? That's fantastic. Uh, yes. Is she here now? Get off the show. <laughs> oh, Winnie. Uh, is, uh, is she Paul coming to Danica, Danica definitely bumps us. I think. Is yeah, she yeah. was hot back then? What was is the she was Is she was as hot? hot? Um, uh, actually, she was pretty damn cute. Yeah. Actually, yeah. the question is and is Winnie Cooper was hot back then as is, <laughs> as is she is now? How is that possible? Oh, we didn't right. offend yeah, him the, earlier. The okay, but but now, tilted, these you know? questions now he's are really horrible. Offended. All right, we're going to our game. Come on. We're going to have you challenge Jack in a game called going down, Jack. You Don't okay, Know do Jack, this. and we've got a song. Woo! Jack Boris, go for it. You don't know Jack, so take that crap back and step your Woo! ass back. You don't know me. You don't know Jack. Woo! All right. Yeah. 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 Very simple game. We have five questions. The answer to all of these is Jack and something. Uh, basically, I'm going to give you guys hints. Fast and Furious, whoever thinks they can do it, you're going to say your name, Jack, or you're going to say Bryson David. OK. OK, we'll do oh, a little okay. test. Like if I was to say, oh, I don't know, his first, uh, his last name is Simpson. He's a famous. Uh, cartoon character that's yellow. Jack. Homer Simpson. There you go. So that's See. how we play. I you thought the answer bars, was Jack. Like, yeah. I was like, who's Jack Simpson? What? Yeah, I'm like, what? <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought that too. Is totally, but I, I got what he was saying now. Uh, he's See, now we're behind. Win. Okay, it's look. Par now we're going down. Oh, yeah? First you want to bet on this? You think he's going to win? Wait, just so I'm clear, though, the answer is going to be Jack something. We can right? read it's going to be Jack something. Which I won't read the other ones. Which you dare read the other ones. Here we go. I'm looking the other way. Jack Homer. All right, let's do this. First one. All right, his first movie role was the title character in a 1958 Roger Corman film. Uh, Jack, 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 David, Jack, David, David. Jack Nicholson. Yes. Yeah. All right, I said they get Little Shop of Horrors. Right, here we go. Was it Little Shop of Horrors? Okay, no, it was no, the Crybaby Killer. Was... Uh, okay. All right, here we go. If Next I'm, one. If I may come in as the judge, you must ding with your name first before answering. We, we yeah. That's what we did. That's what we did. Oh, we have to wait for Stu. 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 to point to you. Okay, wait. I can't hear it. You guys are yelling. You just say Bryce. I'm going to say David. It's a bit easier. Oh, all right. Very Okay. Super. All right, here we go. Next one. This writer's original name is Jack. David, David, David. Jack Kerouac. See, but I, you have to call. I mean, but I, I was said, looking at you and heard that. He, yeah, but, you, but see, if he goes, bata, 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 and I go, I said, Jack, I said, 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 the uh -oh. game is this. Stuart no. says it, and then one of them answers, and then the other one answers the next one. 
But that what? sucks. There's no, no, no competition. That no, just no, I sucks. I want to show these guys In that I'm strong. Man. Then it's just people answering things. I'll just okay. decide who got who set okay. it first. Okay. Watch them. Watch okay. them in the okay. eyes. Watch my eyes. Here we go. Watch their Here eyes. It comes. Okay? Raise your hand. That's how we'll I'll do it. I'll raise my hand. I'm I'm even, just a uh, there will be order in this game. <laughs> you know, we'll have this figured out for next week. There will be order. Bryce Beckham is David Fickus at the Iceman Chronicles. Okay, here we go. Third one. Although known as a musician, he appeared in the 1987 film *The Rosary Murders* as a child. Uh, that was um, as a David Fickett. As, <laughs> as a child, I'm a cha -cha. thinking Jack Johnson. Old, no, nope. playing an altar boy. So you didn't get it. What do we do? Yeah, yeah, keep going. Okay, keep going. Okay. Keep going. Yeah, 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 his other, original, yeah. known as his original surname is Gillis. Two of his current musical projects. Jack White. Oh. He nailed it. He didn't even have a name, but he didn't ring in. But you know, that's okay. I already, I already got a default. All right, all right. Okay, default. Go. So he gets strong. to hear all the yeah, stuff. Strong. Bad. Bryce Becker, Bad. you have a strong constitution. I do. And yes. as a matter of fact. All right, here we go. We another one. Next one. Then we got one more. This is the last one, I think. No, two more. Okay. This Jack's forerunner was introduced to the world at the Chicago. I got it. Uh, I'm gonna have to say Jack. Jack I think Parr. that was clear. <laughs> Jack Parr, isn't it? No. Oh, no. Good. Good. We can just, oh, let's just listen to okay. everything. Was introduced to the world at the Chicago World's Fair in 1893. Oh, go on. <laughs> it's it's mentioned in a famous old song about baseball. Ah. Oh. oh. Cracker Jack. Yeah. That's not, that's not a person named Jack. That is. So that is. is. That's not a person named Jack. That's a. That's so a, that's earlier. A, that's, no, no. He never said it was a person. He said it was Jack something or a, you know. Jack. In in Jack's defense, he did say it was going to be Jack something. He not did something. say it was not something Jack, Jack. But I like how you switched it up and we got the point. You're Mr. Peaceful. I don't like your diplomacy. Why are, why are you so far, you know, I'm not. So I'm just impressed with our which team. one of you is smarter. Right. You're like, oh no, uh, he's we're both interesting in different would it, ways. Would it help you both? To Jack, I still like you better than John. It's awesome. <laughs> we're, kicking, we're both beating John in this game. Oh, yeah, great. Yeah, 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 John's the He's big loser. Charm. This is a spirited game. Right. Yes. Here we go. Last one. I don't know who's in the I'm lead. Go a, I'm going to go on a limb. I'm going to go on a limb here. Uh, well, there are all these discrepancies. <laughs> <laughs> let's call it a draw. I want to go out on a limb. This one's sudden death. Sudden death. We'll make this I guess I'll death. just pick okay, a win. Okay, let's call this one sudden death. Yeah. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay, here we go. So we just shout out the answer? Whoever, it's got to be a hand. I'm gonna put the hand up when the it comes. Hand. All right, the so hand. All right. So I get. I'll see that. Okay. Watch. Right, you go. watch with your ojos. Don't say the Los answer. Ojos. Until Los ojos. Los ojos. That's both these. Try to do that. Here we go. Um, okay. Here we go. All right. Here we go. Okay. I'm excited. He got an early start in the business world, Price making and selling moonshine at the age of. Got it. Jack. Jack Daniels. He got it. Yes. Oh, it was not it. in I know. Yes. It's yes. Drinking. Yes. Yes. And that's him again. Do. I you don't know say, Jack. Jack, you take it away. Jack. I want to say, take that Jack. we lost because he's a I drunk. I totally <laughs> kicked your okay. asses. You don't know Jack. All right. Suck it. Whoa. Uh, yeah. suck, so wait, suck it. Armpit. We won three to two, didn't we? Uh, no. no. That no. was sudden death. Yeah. We all agree. Sudden death. Sudden death. Look. Right, but so sudden death, he we won three to two. He has a fair constitution, <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I understand. Like, like, he won that round, we I, won the I'm whole game. I'm full of constitution. I'm clear about this. Sudden death, there will be no discrepancies. Way to go! No. Way to go, Canada! Okay, no All right, here we go. allowed. <laughs> All right, we are uh, we're live. It's uh, eight forty-seven. We have uh, David Fickus, Bryce Beckham. They uh, created, wrote, PA, starred in, executive produced <laughs> the Iceman Chronicles. We it's do on, things. It's on my damn channel. It yes. Is. It sounds it sounds a little dicky. Like my it's my damn channel. Mine. Like, God dang it! Well, and, and, but it's sharing too. Yeah. It's like but these are for you. Right. You know. And we, I, but we made it for you. But it's very yeah. like. But it's mine. I grew up and that's mine. My yeah. damn channel. It, 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 like they could take the channel and go home if right. they want. If they yeah. want, indeed. <laughs> if you piss ball. them off, like fine. You can find them on my damn channel. Um, you can also find them right here, right now. Okay, here we go. Oh, that's uh, true. Yes, yeah, Sergeant Silence do is high on shoe polish. Oh. I wouldn't call Crystal Meth shoe polish, but I like oh. your. Wait, so it's Ritalin you and Crystal it. Meth now? Ever... It's actually do... really good for shining. Yeah, shoes. Yeah, shining shoes with Crystal Meth, it's very shiny. I don't nice. do that. I don't. So it makes your skin good. The sir. only thing I inhale <laughs> is rainbows, <laughs> dreams, and model airplane glue. That is it. Mm. And cocaine. <laughs> that is it. All right, uh, we have to get out of here with you guys. Uh, so we're gonna do something called the 59 second gauntlet. Now, uh, that is 59 seconds to answer all these questions. I have pre-selected 
Bryce to do this. Oh, okay, okay. But you can be his assist man. Oh. Now, I will have oh, you great. know. I have his, an assist man. His mind fluffer. You know what? Great. <laughs> Excellent. Uh, all right, so you know happy what? to be uh, here. I got to give it to him now. Uh, that's you. fine. You're out on that's this. fine. Okay. He's quicker. You guys can do this together, even though Brian's going to hate me through the glass for this. You can do this together. It's just that nobody does it well together. Here's a, I'm going to throw questions at you. Okay. Nobody very rarely gets through this. We had what? See? Brian hates me silently through the glass. We will, Brian will he do doesn't it. hate you. Brian will do no, it. He, but he's giving me But it's a speed thing. He's you, giving, you gotta give quick you answers. You got it, and they gotta be good. Okay. 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 Why so, don't we switch up? Why don't we just switch up? 20% right, of right. guests. Bing, bang, bing, bang, right. bing, yes. bang. Okay, you ready? All right, LV. Oh, do, we, do you wanna do the uh, set it up with the song? No. <laughs> <laughs> Jack, Jack, uh, he's you know, good. John would never pull. You that. have a strong constitution. John never gonna pull. John, that John would have never. failed in that. Yeah. All right, here we go. All right, fifty-nine second gauntlet. LV, give us the timer. Ready? Are you going Three, or am I two, going? One, start. Porn star name. Dick Cubby. Most embarrassing moment in your life. This. In high school, I was. Most likely to be famous. Biggest sadly. Biggest star you've ever met. Jim Carrey. Biggest jerk in grade school. Jason Labuda? Song playing while you lost your virginity. <laughs> ben Folds, Brick, which is sadly about oh, abortion. Yeah. One thing on your iPod. Ben Folds, Brick, which is sadly about <laughs> abortion. Rather be, uh, uh, rather date Audrey Hepburn or Marilyn Monroe? Audrey Hepburn, but I'd let Marilyn watch. <laughs> Would you rather be Elvis or Sinatra? Both. Give it to flight or be a billionaire? Uh, a billionaire to create wings that were very expensive. Title of your memoirs? Uh, 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 live from the future with <laughs> David Fickus. Well, the place you go to think? Uh, my, my special place. Worst guy's name? Uh, Carl. High school sneakers? Uh, Stan Smith. Favorite charity? Uh, 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 the, the one about... Uh, uh, <laughs> oh! <laughs> You didn't. You had one less. Oh, Parkinson's. Fine. I was trying oh. to. I was shaking trying to say Parkinson's. <laughs> no, silly. Catherine was Hepburn Nambla. knows. Nambla. How about a band for my guest, Bryce Beckham and David? Oh. Thank you. Yes. Oh, we were, we were very good. Show. We were oh. very good. They were amazing. Oh, yeah. All right. We don't need to plug the Jap show. We, we, we have a live show on Thursday. Oh, right. You guys are still talking. Now. That's <laughs> the weirdest part now. Is that even though I just. Parkinson's. Fun. Okay. <laughs> Go to all their, well, actually, give all your links and then we'll get you out of here in the yeah, most awkward way possible. Drama34.com, mydamnchannel.com is where the Iceman Chronicles is. Japs. Uh, the Jewish American Princesses. Japs. They're playing uh, at the Aqua Lounge this Thursday night at 9 30. What's that? I want to be It's involved. our band. Come to it. We need more Jews. It. Yes. Where Jews are welcome. Yeah, iTunes. You can get their These album on my iTunes Jews. and you can see all this stuff at drama34.com. Drama34 is what it is. There it is. Right. Thank, thank, thank you. There we go. Thank you. We got thank all you. the plugs in. Hooray for us. <laughs> <laughs> all right. You guys just want to start this interview again? What is happening? Yes. All right. Um, great guests, and uh, the, you can actually hang out with us because we have one more bit to do that we love every show, uh, and this is called the bit that's sweeping the nation. Yes. It's time for Strictly Platonic. Jack. I don't want to date you. I don't want to rape you, girl. Strictly Platonic. Woo. I don't want to slow dance. I don't want to romance, girl. Strictly Platonic, Strictly Platonic, Strictly Platonic. John's in jail. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, John's time. Jail edition. Strictly Platonic. These are actual messages I find in the Strictly Platonic section of Craigslist. The only thing I do is I'll delete or shorten some text. That's it. I don't change any of the verbiage, vocabulary, or any of the punctuation. First one. Who wants to get married? <laughs> <laughs> And the message, <laughs> who wants to get married, hit me up. In the subject line, put I do. <laughs> <laughs> all right, there's our first one. No, 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 yes. that's not true. That is all oh, true. God. You can find it. That's in You can find platonic. it. Here we go. Mm. That guy needs a green card. Next one, <laughs> after midnight, a hundred roses, dollars, ladies. Ladies, come over to my place after midnight madness and give me a new lap dance, a hundred roses. What? Oh, wait, no, wait. no, wait. No, I know what that means. 
I, I, no. It means nude lap dance. No, no, no. <laughs> it means no. 100 raised roses? No, 100 roses is $100. You have to say roses. It's lingo because my friend ordered a prostitute uh, once from Craigslist. Your friend? Oh, no, no, all we, right. we all know that. It's just. Oh, you knew that? I, I knew that. No, we yeah, thought he was actually going to give her a rose. Here, here's the part like I like at the end. Real ad. No spammers, no pick. <laughs> no pick. Yeah. All right, here we go. So far, there's Next very one. little platonic about it. Here we go. That's what's You're so catching awesome on. It. Oh, oh <laughs> I see. Bryce Beckham, I like you. All right. Next one reads, drinking, buddy. And he put a hyphen, or he put the apostrophe on drinking. New to town and need a friend? So, let me guess. You just moved to town with aspirations of being discovered. <laughs> as Hollywood's latest and greatest talent. And you are all brimming with excitement about your future superstardom. Only one problem, you don't know a single person in town. Well, you do now. <laughs> <laughs> Come on down, I'll be your drinking buddy. And then, dot, 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 no, I am not a loser with no friends. I've got tons of them, but there's always room for one more. Oh, also, I'm not gay. Not that it matters. <laughs> Uh, but I'll even meet you at a gay bar if that's your preference. Wow. Wow. That's I mean, my preference. Hey, what's up, man? I'm looking for bros to hang. Let's go down to the uh, Leather Saddle Ranch. <laughs> All right, here we go. Uh, uh, this one, I swear to you, Jesse Schneiderman, I promise you through the camera, I change not one word. Oh, God. I change it not one word. All right, that. aquatic love. Oh boy. <laughs> Do you like to swim? Are you a mammal? <laughs> will you be my dolphin princess? Oh. You will have sleek, rubbery skin and communicate via sonar. Wow. Ideally, you will let me ride you and videotape it so that I can put it on YouTube and become internet famous. <laughs> Ideally. <laughs> you know the sad thing about that? That's, the guy, that's the guy that got eaten by that killer whale like All three right. days ago. No, but wait a second. Too soon? Is, okay. he, Too soon? is he looking? Is he really looking for a dolphin? That's what it said. <laughs> we got three more. We got to power through these. I want to know how the dolphin's supposed to reply to that. Eh? Yeah. <laughs> it's like wow. Through sonar. Well, you will, let, yeah, you will let me ride you and tape it ideally. <laughs> um, all right, here we go. Three more. We'll go through these real quick. Come sleep over, platonic. <laughs> Feel like cuddling, snuggling, spooning? Me too. <laughs> Absolutely platonic. Nothing weird. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, last one. I got two more, two more, two more. God, I promise you these are gold. Bear hug wrestling. <laughs> Looking to do some bear hug wrestling. Workouts, pummeling, etc. <laughs> <Et cetera. laughs> All right, loose term. let your mind go. Last you know? one. Now, for this one to just, uh, All of it. I just need you to know that this one was written in all caps. So if I shout, it's because I'm all capping it. And I will try to put in the weird commas that were right after letters and no spaces. Try and feel them with me. Sigle looking. <laughs> <laughs> I would like to date lady from 18 to 50. Well fit, just for fun, okay, if married. I don't smoke, do dugs, occasional drink, have RV, mm, boat, what? that I like to travel, live in Las Vegas, and saka, don't bother me with nonsense, is all 100% <laughs> just fun. And sex, maybe? Wow. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And that's oh. Sydney Matonic, yeah! Take it away! <laughs> I don't want a dolphin. Yeah. I don't want a mighty morphin Power Ranger. It's strictly platonic. There you go. Look at that title. I don't want a slow dance. I don't, I don't want, want a romance, romance girl. girl. It's strictly platonic. Strictly platonic. Strictly platonic. Dolphin edition. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Uh, that is our show. How about a big hand for our guest, Bryce yeah. Beckham, David Beckham? Yeah. How about a big hand? How about a big hand for Jack Beckham?
Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you so much. Jesse Schneiderman, producer LV, Tom K for doing our graphics, Jared and the amazing team here at the stream, Brian, Grandma, we love you. If you want to donate, you can check out the stream.tv slash live for the future. Five bucks gets you a sticker, ten bucks a signed picture. And uh, next week we'll be back with comedian extraordinaire. We have none other than the giant Sil Sarah Silverman. Lo yes. Nice. Can you believe? The giant the, no, Sarah wait. Hold on. Wait. Yeah. <laughs> wait. No, She's it's not really tall. <laughs> okay. It's Brian Posehn from oh. the Sarah Silverman program <laughs> and Don <laughs> Olivieri, amazing actor, cherry pie dude. I seriously feel high watching the show. Well, we feel high. Uh, it's better when you get this show later and you grind it up and cut it up and with a water <laughs> pipe. It's even better. That's our show. Uh, we'll see you next week on Live from the Future. Check out livefromthefuture.com. Add us on Twitter. Dot com slash live from future. Now get out. Go get That's your pants That's our show. On. We're gonna say yeah. good now. We'd love to stay forever, but we just ain't right. That's our show. We're gonna say good night. But guess we're all so funny, and they sparkled them alive. And you know when that thing was happening, when they were like, "Who's that dude? Where the frick is John?" <laughs> And then I was like, I totally owned those guys in that contest when it went to sudden death. Oh, yeah. I want to say what's up to X Sweet, X Jesus, H Macy, Woozle, Vegs, Tobe Mac, This Is Really Ace, The Josh, The Bostonian, Telemundo, Stolkman, Spiky, Sociology Geek, Sergeant Silent, Service, and Your Shutter, Sean O's, S. Carroll, Ripple, Real Men, Wear Kilts, Piston Hammer, Penguin Lord, Orion the Hunter, O Dog, Mr. Paisley, Movie Map, Monk Man, Colez, Lila, Loyal, Casanova, Knight.